Hello, you're welcome to the news in brief on Graphic Online. In the headlines, Ghana's largest bulk electricity supply point in Pokwase commissioned. Law students denied admission to the Ghana School of Law present petition to parliament. Fanny faced to undergo drug use test and psychiatric examination. Shatawale and accomplices to face court for feigning gunshot attack. And Volta Region adjudged Best Regional Coordinating Council in 2020. News in Brief is brought to you by Graphic News Plus. Download your Graphic News Plus now and choose your preferred package daily, weekly, monthly, and annually and access free news on various interest areas as well. Graphic News Plus, connecting people through news. And now the news in brief. Ghana's largest bulk electricity supply point located in Pokwasi in the greater Accra region has been commissioned. President Nana Dudankwa Akufuado commissioned the Pokwasi bulk supply point, a 330 kilovolt substation, on Wednesday. It is designed to improve the supply and distribution of electricity for consumers in the northern areas of Accra. Funded by the Millennium Challenge Corporation, MCC, to the tune of $47 million, the supply point, according to President Akufuado, is a testimony to government's commitment to improving electricity supply in Ghana. The president stated that the Pokwasi bulk supply point, whose construction commenced in February 2019, is also the fourth bulk supply point in Accra. It is the first 330 kilovolt bulk supply point in Accra, and it is the most technologically advanced substation in Ghana. Law students wanting admission to the Ghana School of Law to pursue the professional law program, but have been denied admission today presented a petition to parliament. The students say they passed the entrance exams for admission but have been denied. They therefore want an intervention from Parliament. National Association of Law Students hit the streets of Accra to protest the Ghana School of Law entrance exam failures. The aggrieved candidates are accusing the Ghana Legal Council of their inability to gain admission following a new quota system. For this year's exam, the rule changed, so candidates had to score at least 50% in both sessions. However, the affected students said the new rule was unknown to them before they took the exam. The minority leader in parliament, Mr. Harun Idrisu, received the petition on behalf of the speaker. Comedian Fanny Face, known in real life as Nanaya Odro Boatin, is to face a psychiatric examination and a drug use test. This follows his arrest last Monday by the police for threatening some people with death. The police on Wednesday requested the Kaneshi District Court to grant them permission and an order to examine the comedian for drug use and psychiatric examination. The drug use test is to be conducted at the police hospital while the psychological test is to be conducted at a public psychiatric hospital in Accra. The court did not take the plea of the accused as he was not yet examined psychologically. The outcome of the two tests will determine the next action to be taken by the police. The police has explained that the history of Fanny Face made them to request for the test. In February 2021, the Ofakor District Court committed Fanny Fine to the psychiatric hospital for two weeks. That was after he had been arrested by the police in Kaswa for unlawfully discharging a firearm at a pub. The Ofakor Secute Court ordered the police to send Fanny Face to the Accra Psychiatric Hospital for examination, explaining that he did not sound normal when he appeared before the court. Dancehall artist Shatawale and his two accomplices, arrested by the police for publishing false information, is to be arraigned in court. The police has accused them of creating public fear and panic by feigning a shooting incident. Investigations are still underway, but the police has hinted that they were preparing to charge them in court. Known formally as Charles Ni Ama Mensa, he has been detained together with his accomplice Kojo Owusu Kranting, also known as Nana Do, and Eric Venato, alias Ganji, at the Accra Regional Police Command. The police has said preliminary investigations has revealed that the widely reported gunshot attack on Shatawale on Monday was a hoax. The pastor, Jesus Ahuafe, who Shatawale claims made a prophecy about the shooting incident, is also in police custody assisting with investigations. And in our last story, the Volta Regional Coordinating Council has been adjudged the best among the 16 councils in Ghana in the 2020 Annual Local Governance Service Performance Contract. The Volta region beat the Savannah and Bono East regions, which were adjudged second and third respectively, to clinch the coveted spot. 
at an award ceremony in Accra, the Nkranza district in Bono East region was also adjudged the best performing district in the rankings of metropolitan, municipal and district assemblies. The remaining MMDAs awarded in ascending order were Ga East, Efija Kwabre North, Tema West, Kwewu West, La Dade Kotopon, Brim Central, Ablekuma West, Shefo Eti Mokwa and Kasina Nankana West Districts. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again with another edition. Stay safe and protect yourself from COVID-19. For more news, visit graphic.com.gh or log on to Facebook at Daily Graphic and on YouTube at GraphicGH. I am Enoch Dafa Frimpong. Subscribe now.